Hi, I'm going to walk you through how to find your Google Calendar ID in this video. Um, it takes just a minute. You want to log into the Gmail account that you use for the calendar and go to the calendar page. Um, if you're not sure how to get to that page, click on the nine little squares um, up here next to the circle with your image or your initial. Go ahead and click on that and look for calendar. And that will take you to your calendar page. There we go. Wait for it to load. And what you're looking for over here on the left under the list of my calendars is the calendar that you want to share. So I'm going to go ahead and share this first calendar. To do that, we'll just click on the three dots and go to settings and sharing. And once you're in the calendar settings, you're going to want to make sure that your access permissions are make available to public. You want that box to be checked and you want to be able to see all event details. The other option is see only free or busy and that doesn't give you enough information on your website calendar. So you want to make sure see all event details is set. So once you have these two settings and if you aren't able to change those settings you will need to check with your IT person who set up your Gmail or G Suite account um, and have them change it so that you are able to make a calendar public. They should be able to do that for you. Um, once you've got that go ahead and scroll down a little bit further and we're going down to integrate calendar. And you're looking for this very first item here, calendar ID. Um, it will often look just like the email address of the calendar that you're using. And if not, it might be a little bit longer if it's a group's calendar or something special. Um, it might be a, a little bit longer, but that is basically all we need. Go ahead and email that over to us and we'll get that into your calendar for you and get that set up.